and welcome back. Look behind you. This is part 38 of Let's Play Metal Gear Solid. Now. Is she alive? I'm not sure. She was alive a few hours ago. Poor girl kept calling your name. Meryl, stupid woman. Falling in love with a man who doesn't even have a name. I have a name. No, we have no past, no future. And even if we did, it wouldn't be truly ours. You and I are just copies of our father, Big Boss. Let Meryl go. As soon as we've finished our business, we're almost out of time. You're talking about Fox time. No. It seems now that the Pentagon knows that Metal Gear is destroyed. They've arrived at a decision. They won't even need a BDA. If you want the details, why don't you ask your precious Colonel Campbell? Colonel, can you hear me? Yes, I'm listening. What is the Pentagon trying to do? Colonel, answer me. The Secretary of Defense has taken over active control of this operation. He's on his way there by AWACS. What for? To bomb the place. What? Not only that, V-2 bombers just lifted off from Galena Air Force Base. They're carrying B-6113 surface-piercing tactical nuclear bombs. What? Metal Gear is destroyed. Tell the Secretary of Defense. The Secretary of Defense heard that Naomi double-crossed us, and he's worried about Fox Die. Now that there's no more danger of a nuclear strike from Metal Gear, he's going to do whatever's necessary to cover up the truth of what really happened here. He's going to drop a nuclear bomb to vaporize all the evidence along with anyone who knows anything. Don't worry, Snake. I'll stop the nuclear strike. How? I may only be a figurehead here, but I'm still officially in command of this mission. If I issue an order to delay the strike, it'll confuse the chain of command and at least buy you some time. It'll give you a chance to escape. But, Colonel, if you do that... It's okay, Snake. The truth is, Foxhound was already the subject of an undercover investigation. Merrill was transferred to this base just before the terrorist attack as a way of manipulating me. Those bastards. I'm sorry. They forced me to cooperate in exchange for her life. You better get out of there, Snake. Are you sure? It'll be bad for you. Don't worry. It's the least I can do for you, after all the lies. Colonel. I'm ordering them to cancel the bombing run. After that, there's no turning back. What? What are you doing? What? Colonel. Snake! Mei Ling, what happened to the Colonel? I don't believe it. What happened? Snake, the Colonel! Roy Campbell has been relieved of duty. This is the Secretary of Defense, Jim Houseman. Put the Colonel back on. He's been placed under arrest for leaking top secret information and for the crime of high treason. Ridiculous. Yes, he's a ridiculous man. He truly believed that he was in command of this operation. You bastard. There won't be a speck of evidence left. I'm sure the President would want the same thing. President ordered this? The President is a busy man. I have complete authority here. How do you plan on explaining a nuclear attack on Alaska to the media? Don't worry. We've prepared a convincing cover story. We'll simply say that the terrorists exploded a nuclear device. Smart. You'll be murdering everyone here. The scientists, the genome army, everyone. Donald, the DARPA chief is already dead. So, you didn't mean to kill the DARPA chief after all? He was my friend. And you could care less about what happens to everybody else, huh? Well, if you give me the optic disc, I might consider saving them. What are you talking about? Metal Gear's test data. Donald was supposed to bring it back. I don't have it. I see. Oh well, that's okay. You two are an embarrassment from the 1970s. Our country's dirty little secret. You can't be allowed to live. Well, the bombs will be dropping soon, and you two have a lot of catching up to do. <laughs> Farewell. <laughs> There's no way out for us.
Let's finish this before the air strike. You stole everything from me. Only your death can satisfy me. Only your death can return to me what is rightly mine. She'll make a beautiful sacrifice for our final battle. Do you see this? It will be the time limit for our final battle. This nuclear module is set to detonate at the precise moment of her death. If you will, you might still be able to save her. You could enjoy one brief moment of love before the end. If you cross this line, you fall. At this height, it will kill even you. So close. No! Oh, fucking shit! <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Good to Fuck. Sorry about that, guys. And yeah, we're just about running out of time anyway, so. Um, Let's see if we can get this done this time. A little less failure. Oh shit. Shit. Get some!
son of a bitch. Oh my god, if you even- you out of the no, no, you. If he fucking kills me again, I'm- no, no, you. Oh, come on, one more, we got like, ten seconds. <laughs> Holy shit! Alright, uh, yeah, thanks for watching and be sure to come back for part 39 of Let's Play Metal Gear Solid. See ya.